Hey, what's up guys, it's your boy King Virgo 95 back at you with another video. Hopefully everybody's enjoying their day. Today is August 27th. Welcome to my channel. Like, comment, subscribe, tell a friend. Um, this is just an air view of my garden over there on the side, as you can see. Um, it ain't much of great of anything. It's just um simple garden, first time growing. So um yeah, let's get into this video. Like I said once before, today is August 27, 2019, and hopefully you guys like my plant journey as much as I do. Yeah, so this is my squash. Look how big it's getting. Um, this was about a couple weeks ago. Um, they're very they're small right now. I put them on like uh, wood and stuff like that so that they, they could um, not get any rot in them as they grow. Um, this is one squash. I want to say it's about like two inches. My leaves, I was, at first I was thinking that my leaves was getting um, mildew spots on them. I pulled off the um, the flower around that one and the back there, there's another um, squash that's growing. Um, the flower didn't open up yet. Back there is my lemon cucumbers, they're starting to grow and bud and stuff like that. But they're taking forever. That's the longest one I've ever to actually show me the fruit. But they're starting, you can see them. I'll give you a close up in a few so you can see what it looks like. Um, yeah, all the little flowers are um, male and female flowers. And here's my precious um, pumpkin flower. I had a multiple of four pumpkins on there, but then one of them I thought they were, was dying, so I broke it off. So now I have three. Um, as you can see, yeah, forget my nails. Um, they were kind of dirty because I was digging in dirt and stuff like that. But um, yep, that's a pumpkin right there. Um, yeah, all these, all my plants, I'm like, they kind of grew kind of fast. It's been like almost a three month journey. At the end of September, it'll be a be three months. Um, I actually. Like started making like little mounds, like dirt mounds, like here and there for the plant, like wherever it started rooting, just to give like a healthier growth. And that's my sunflower right there. That's one, one of three that I have. That one is starting to um open up. Uh, that's another sunflower right there. Yep, yep, yep. And then if you look over the corner in the right, you'll see that that is my watermelon. And I, I'm gonna have to like start weeding out some of the leaves because it's like overcrowded and I don't want that mildew effect. I have about like four or five watermelon growing right now. One of them did die, but that's probably because I let it sit on the soil instead of propping it with something under it so that it wouldn't rot. But yeah, this is what my plants look like for the most part. Today is August 20th, 2019, and I'm just giving you a view of the plants that it dropped my ladder. But, um, yeah, look at this squash. It's crazy. They're getting bigger and bigger. And by the day, honestly, like, within, like, rain and stuff like that, my flower opened up, by the way. It just makes, it does something for the plants. You see that little runt right there? It's growing so weird compared to the other ones. Um, and then if you come over here, I didn't even know one was growing over here. Look at this. Look at this sucker. It's getting bigger and bigger. They're not so big right now, but they're getting bigger. And that's my lemon cucumber back there. They're sprouting out more. The petals look like it was like a little mildew effect going on, but I think that's just the pattern of the leaves. As you can see, those are probably male flowers down there. As we get, as we come back around, here's the squash again. And we go over to my pumpkins. Yep. So. What I'm going to do actually is probably let this just flow out right in front of um, both of the garden beds and just see if I'm going to actually get a pumpkin because if I actually get one pumpkin to grow, I'll be happy more than just none at all, if you get what I'm saying. Just didn't say that I was able to grow a pumpkin or just grow anything in the garden. Honestly, all these plants here, I didn't think that I was going to be able to grow them, but I got the opportunity to grow them. I had some good soil 
uh, from the previous neighbors that lived there. As you can see, this is a little more than my house there. But yeah, like I said, that's some good soil. I went to Home Depot, bought a little more soil. Um, I actually used like an organic, organic blend from um, Home Depot. It's within Miracle Grow, and I used like the Miracle Grow um, plant food like enhancer. That kind of worked good, but it also was like there's pros and cons to it because it killed a lot of my plants. Like my when I first started my tomatoes and stuff like that, it killed a lot of my plants. But now I'm growing tomatoes again. Like this bed right here, this new one that started, I got tomatoes, potatoes, and some flowers growing. They haven't sprouted up yet, but in due time they will. So I decided to test my fire pit out um, to see how it would work. Um, it actually came out kind of nice. Now as we walk over to the plants, um, it's nighttime. I was just outside enjoying it. Uh, today is August, I think 21st or 22nd, one of those days, not too sure. I forgot. Um, but as we look at the plants, as we look at the squash, it's getting bigger and bigger by the day. Like I said before, the rain water just does something to the plant that gives it all those type of minerals that it needs in the plant. Like you can um, make a pH water for your um, plants by itself. I necessarily didn't do that, but what I did do, if I did use um, like the faucet water, I would let it sit outside in the sun for about like maybe one or two hours before I actually put it on the plants. Um, yeah, and it worked out for me. As you can see, there's another one that's about to open up. So we got another squash right there. Those my pumpkins down there, like I told you before, the vine is really getting long and it already started another vine which is quite dope like i said before if you like what i'm putting out there like comment subscribe tell a friend and let's keep this going